Okay guys, it's me Imad. So today in this video tutorial, we will learn about how to use the dip switches within an online uh, Vokvi simulator. So how we can do that? First of all, we need to go to Google and here we will write Vokvi and it will lead us to the Vokvi.com. So click on it. And now we can see that there are a lot of circuit projects. Uh, we can take any microcontroller or we will click on Arduino. Okay, we can delete it out. Okay, now we also don't need any sort of coding window, so we will just focus on our right hand side circuits window. So we will click on this addition sign. We will take our dip switch. So dip switch eight. So this is our area of dip switches. Now we will go and we will take LEDs. Okay. Why we are supposed to take LEDs? Because we want to control these LEDs from dip switches. Okay. So we can take multiple LEDs okay and again and again okay so and now we can change their color if you want so click on orange color and it will give us the orange color Now there are six LEDs. We can use some more as well. So we will press Control C and Control V. Okay, wait. Or let me take it from this addition sign. So this is our LED, and one more LED. So this is our so this is our array of LEDs. And now we will go and we will take VCC symbol. This is our VCC symbol and we need to connect it with the all these switches. So this is our VCC. So we will connect it like this, okay? You need to connect all the top terminals or, or the, the, the terminals which are above. You, you have to connect all these terminals with that of what's called as the VCC, okay? We will connect all these terminals. And on this side, we will go and we will connect the positive ends of the LEDs one with every switch and why it is so because switches are always in series why it is so because we want to close them we want to uh, open them close and open so that is why they must be in series switches are always in series so Okay, now we will connect it like this. Now, we have connected the positive ends of the LED lights with the uh, down or these uh, bottom ends of the dip switch okay and uh, we also need to take ground we also need to take ground uh, for the uh, negative or cathode side of the LED so we can do it like this 
and then we can connect it like this and this this Okay, we can arrange the connections. Oh, wait. Uh, like this, we can change it to the black color. Okay, now these are our LEDs. Now, what when we will uh, close the switch, the current will flow from VCC to the switch first terminal, and if our switch is closed, it will move into the next terminals. Close means that both of its ends are connected with each other, and the current will go to this and this path, and it will enter into the anode side of the LED, and then it will. Uh, create certain light inside the LED and then flow out from the cathode terminal and then goes to the ground. This is the uh, pathway of our current. So now we will run it out. Now we can see that no LED is on. Now this is first, this is second, this is fourth, sixth and eighth. Okay. So in this way we can make them on and off if we want. So hopefully you got the concept that how you can use the dip switch within Wokfi online simulator. So thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe.